football fans are watching the Ryder Cup on the course behind me at Whistling Straits, but there is a place offshore to watch some of the tournament. I caught up with some golf lovers on a sailboat where they had a unique view of the Ryder Cup from Lake Michigan. Bob Arsbecker has two passions in life, sailing and golfing. This week, he was able to enjoy both from his 40-foot sailboat named Sociable. This morning's a good example. We spent the morning watching the matches on the golf course, and this afternoon we'll be spending the time on the sailboat. We caught up with his crew at the Sheboygan Harbor, a beautiful day for sailing, but Arsbecker says the view of the golf course is limited. You can see the tee shots. You can usually see their swing, sometimes see the ball. Um, the, the 17 has got a little bit of a tilt that sometimes you can see the putt. This isn't the first time Sociable's been parked off the 17th hole. Bob describes a funny situation back in 2015 for the PGA Championship. They were sitting off the 17th hole when they spotted golfer Luke Donald wearing bright orange pants. I got the crew together and we all said, one, two, three, nice pants, Luke which got a roar from the grandstands, and then Luke gave us a thumbs up and bowed. It's not just all fun and games. They're all in on seeing Team USA win the cup. You're going to be keeping score as well? Yeah, we have, a, we have a little funny system, but we have both a Euro and an American flag. Sociable is a floating scoreboard. Ryder Cup fans can look out to see if the American flag or Europe flag is on top. Arsbecker says having the Ryder Cup in our backyard is a huge win for Wisconsin. I think it's phenomenal what Herb Kohler has done um, in building out golf in Wisconsin. What he's built here and to have this Ryder Cup, it, this course was really built for that. And Bob tells me they will be back out there this weekend if the weather is good enough to sail.